Welcome back to more Kunai, everybody. So on the last episode, we arrived back at this camp area here in the artificial desert, and we have to basically report what we found, which, you know, should be nice, but we also can probably buy something. Let's see what we can get here. Because we can get this to charge attack, or we can also upgrade... I don't know, should I do this, maybe? Uh, I mean, the charge attack might actually be useful. Who knows? And there's also a slingshot thing. I don't care too much about that, though. Because lightning strike. I'm just going to go with um, I'll go with the charge attack. Let's go ahead and install this thing. I think it would be useful to do this. Okay, it's 3-3-3. Three, 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 and I can actually get maybe what? This thing? Sure, let's get steady ground. It says to improve your footwork and keep your balance while throwing shurikens. I didn't even know that it was like... Oh, I see. You can just do it more, like, smoothly now, if that makes sense. Okay, well, anyway. <clears throat> now we're gonna go over here and talk to... Wait a minute. Where was the guy? Hold on. He's checking the access switch of the subnet right now. If you're looking... Oh, okay, I see. I'm such an idiot, man. We gotta go this way. Here you are. To think somebody would return from the shrine. I'm starting to like you, Tabby. Wait, wait, hold on. Am I recording? Hold on. Okay, I am. <laughs> I'm sorry. I mean, obviously, you... If you're watching this video, you knew I was, um, you know, obviously, but... And if I wasn't, you would never hear this anyway. You know what I'm saying right now, but... That's what's kind of funny about this, but... Anyway, we're gonna go ahead and hit that. The door has opened. The door has indeed opened, and we can go on through. Let's do this. Okay, so this just does the same thing, I'm guessing. Yep, it does. And this is going to take us into the abandoned subnet. The next map of the game. Awesome. Okay, I can't interact with any of this stuff. That's fine. We're just going to keep moving. So, it looks like you can interact with this stuff. Hmm. Leave me alone, I'm busy. Uh, okay. Sure, I, I suppose I'll leave you alone. You know what I should have... Oh my god, I just realized something I should have done. At the end of this hall, there's metal beer. He's a black side, it's always down here. He can be a bit grumpy, but that has... But that probably has to do with his forge not working. Oh, I gotta, like, fix it? Hello, you. What? My forge, my beautiful forge. It hasn't worked in ages. The lava flow is blocked by something down below. Usually I would just go down there and fix it, but something is lurking in the depths. Perhaps you could fix it for me? I'll help you out in return. Oh. Um, okay. Let's do it. So, where the hell am I? Oh, okay. Yeah, there's a thing down there, but I think you actually accessed that one from the other side. Pretty sure. We'll see. Here's a save point. We'll take the save. Gladly. I don't know if I need to talk to this girl. Probably not. Yeah, they really say anything important, you know? Okay, so from here there is... Okay, there's this here. Another one of those thingies. But I don't care about that too much. Haunted Factory. There's a fear of weapon hidden somewhere inside. Supposedly it allows one to float for brief periods of time. Oh my god. Well, that's crazy, isn't it? Okay, so I need to actually see how in the world I'm going to get over there. Because these two areas... No, that's not how you actually go there. We'll see. I went ahead and sent some bots out. They're headed for the haunted factory. It's the same place you found those shiny kunai. Thanks to you, we now have the power of those shuriken. We can finally enter areas of the haunted factory that were inaccessible. Go find them and see how close they are to getting access to the back. There's the bats? Uh-huh. Hmm. Okay, well, um... Okay, so I can go over here. That's for... <coughs> oh, God. Okay, this is the fourth piece. That's going to complete a heart segment, which does actually improve our life by a little bit. Nice. But, like I was saying, there, there's actually another thing over there, but I don't remember how to do this, actually. Do I have to go from the other side?
How do you do that? Maybe it's up here. Aha, there it is, okay. Yeah, so there's only two treasures here in the abandoned subnet. Um, or wait, no, sorry, there might be three, sorry. I meant three. There's three and we already have two. That's a new hat right there, cool. Um, so the pathway to the left over here actually leads to Ro Robopolis, but we can't go there yet. That's going to be another map that we'll explore later in the game. And then the one over here, let me actually check this out. This one, the, ooh, bats. Hmm, it's kind of hard to get those. They're moving around a lot. Yeah, the one over here, I think goes back into, I think it's the Fallen City, actually. Your tablet sensors start to tingle. Oh shit, I should have actually saved the I'm such an idiot. Whoops. Don't I have to like... Yeah, because a regular katana is not going to work here. Oh my god. Go! Just got to be patient with this. This is also why having the... Oh my god. Dude, oh, I freaking fail that miserably. This is why having the um the ability to to like gradually heal is actually very very useful. What? Oh, what? What the hell was that? I think that was a glitch. It's supposed to be open. Okay, that timing is actually insanely hard to pull off. I don't know why. why I'm failing that miserably. I should just be doing that. There we go. That's much better. But yeah, the ability to um casually heal, you know, like over time, it's it is so amazing. Like it is seriously fantastic. Because if you are able to stall out boss battles like this, like for example, if I didn't have that ability, I would have been dead. But the fact that I'm healing, you know, gradually, like very gradually, it's actually very nice. You know? What is this? Here we get the... Monitor. What the hell? That is another... Uh, wow. Okay. Well, let's see how many we have now. That's a fair amount of hats right there, but... Alright, we're gonna keep going. So this is in fact going to take us into... Oh yeah, by the way, so that's every single thing in Abandoned Subnet now. In case you're wondering. Uh, but anyway, now we can actually... So we're back in... Wait. Is this... I, I didn't pay attention. Oh, it's... Wait, it's crypt, Crypto Mines. I didn't think it was actually Crypto Mines. Oh, shoot. The thing with the Crypto Mines, though, is that... Well, I guess we can see how far we can get here, but I don't think I... We're going to get too far. Like, I'm pretty sure I'm not supposed to... Oh god, like be here yet. There's a switch. I feel like I should get out of here. Because the crypto mines, I know I'm gonna need another ability later on to be able to access more of this. Um, but I think that is actually what opens up the ability to go to the forge and get upgrades. I'm pretty sure. Oh, Tabby, you just do something? Great, Metal Beard just told us a lot of story of filling in this forge again. Looks like he did it him a solid. Find him in the abandoned subnet. You might want to see what he's got in store for you. Yeah, too bad I already blew all my money. But it would have been nice to get some of those upgrades. But, yeah, I feel like I shouldn't be here yet. I don't think I'm supposed to be there. I don't specifically remember this. But I'm going to actually turn back because I believe the better option is to go up towards the fallen city instead. Which again, it would be, it would be towards this direction. Give me this. Give me all this money. Okay, so it'd be somewhere. Um, I think it's gonna be. It'd be this way. What the hell? Look at that mindlessly wandering around in the cage. Not so tough now, are we? What are you doing? Are you crazy? Well, they're nothing crazy. What are you talking about? Yeah, I don't know what the hell that guy, that guy's problem is, but 
Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and go over here and save first before we, you know, advance. But I'm gonna see if I'm actually allowed to go back into the, the Fallen City, which would be specifically to the left side. Yeah, see, I actually can. I think this is what I'm supposed to actually do. I'm pretty sure. I need as much money as possible. I need to grab all the money I can possibly find. But, yeah, so... Yeah, that's going to lead specifically right over there. Okay. So. Back in the Fallen City, which it's been a while since I've been here... But all of this section over here is actually the beginning of the game. This over here leads to the Quantum Forest, which is another way going back there. We got the Katana here, we got the Top Hat item around there. Um, so yeah, you know, just over here is pretty much done except the entrance to the Quantum Forest if we want to go back that way. So we're not too focused on that. But what we probably do want to do is... How many chests do I have? One out of five. Okay, it's only five chests in here. We've only obtained one. Which, again, I believe it's the, um... That, the top hatches. I think we got the top hatches. Okay, so from here, the pathway on the bottom will, in fact, lead all the way back around. Um, I mean, I suppose I could go that way. No, actually, I don't want to go that way. I want to start by going to the top. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, so it'd be yeah, right over here. So we're gonna go like this. Here's a save point, which we'll take. But there are two chests that we want to obtain over here. Hopefully we can get them both right now. I'm not sure if we can, but we gotta try. So the first one will actually be right past this room on the top, top left, I believe, in this room over here. Yeah, be right over here. Whoops. Ran right into you, huh? Okay. We're in this room. Okay, we want to make sure we kill that guy. There we go. Here's a chest. And this contains... Another hat. This is a... I believe this is called a cap. There we go. Yeah, I think that's it for this room. Yeah, it looks like it's it. That's not bad. Okay. So we're done there. The next one that we want to actually get will be... <clears throat> and this room is going to be up here. I don't know if we can go there yet, but let's give it a shot. We can try. Uh, looks like we actually cannot... Because we would need the, um... Yeah. <clears throat> That'd be a different ability that we have to obtain. Okay, so we can't do that yet. That's unfortunate, but oh well. So, what we have to do... Is just go the other way now. Yeah, to go down like that. So we have to just go all the way around here in this area. I suppose we'll save again. Doesn't hurt. And then here we're going to go to the right. Oh shoot, I did not think there were going to be enemies in there. Man, the downward attack feels very similar to Hollow Knight. Like, you get very big Hollow Knight vibes when you do that downward slash. Oh man, that actually hurt me. Give me that money. Okay, so we're getting there. It's kind of a long way, <laughs> you know, to get all the way there. But I'm also trying to collect all the money on the way because I do need money if I want to, you know, have any shot at getting all these big, massive upgrades that I'm looking for. Okay, so it's somewhere... Wait a minute, actually, hold on a second. Sorry, I'm such an idiot. There should be a chest to the left over here. Why did I get this? Right here. Yeah, there totally is one. Oh my god. 
There we go. This is another hard piece. So, we'll just get this. We need three more to uh, get another, you know, another health upgrade. Yeah, my bad on that. Okay, so there's two chests. Oh, what the hell? You respawn really fast. So, there's two chests left to obtain. One we cannot get yet. The other one is actually at the top, I think. Wait a minute, though. Shit, I think I'm actually wrong. I may not have the top hat. I'm looking at it now. And I feel like the other chest is actually <laughs> the other one instead. That's my bad. We'll see. We'll see how this goes. Okay, so we're gonna go... What the hell? Can I hit those? Oh no. Yeah, we'll go like this. And then the okay that side will lead to the haunted factory, which we don't really care for right now. This door does open. That's important to know. And then this over here leads to the Zen Mountains, which uh, we cannot access yet because there's giant boulders, as you can see. Oh shoot, I actually let him hit me. Alright, so from this room, yeah, there's gonna be... I really have to confirm this right now because I have to make sure about this. I don't want to mess this up and forget which one is actually the one that I am, in fact, missing. So it's, uh... Oh god, I'm gonna get hit. Yeah, it'd be to the left. Okay, so you see this room here? Right up here. Give me all this money. No, give me the money. Thank you. Okay, so right... I did get that one, which means I did not get the top hat. Whoa. Alright, well that's good to know. I'm gonna want to go to the haunted factory though, so I think I'm just gonna have to uh, make my way all the way that way. Gonna try to speed us up, you know. I'll get some money. Wait, get, give me the money. I want the money. Oh yeah, that's that mountain. So we're gonna drop and head to the right. This way, into the haunted factory. So the haunted factory, it is the next place that we need to go to in terms of story. You know, in terms of where we're gonna get the next upgrade. So we're from that side now. This one has 10 different chests and we only have one of them, which is crazy. But I'm going to start by going to the top, I think. Well, maybe. We'll see. Because this is where I defeated, yeah, I defeated the gar garbage collector, which was over there. So I already have that chest, but that's the only one that I have. Um, so the closest other chest that I can see that I'm going to require is there is one right over here somewhere oh Jesus yeah that freaking recoil thing you know I was just talking about that okay I think it's right over I think it's actually over here yep there it is so this chest will have some money perfect 42 additional money we'll take that so that's one, but everything over here is actually already, yeah, like that's already obtained, so I can just proceed down, I believe, and go to the next room. Oh, I can't go that way. Yes, I can. Yes, I can. I got this. Perfect. Okay, so from here, just gotta make our way across. I don't know what the hell this enemy is. What in the world? That thing's a bit, uh, a bit of a crazy enemy. Hmm. Here we got some more new enemies. We are in a new area after all. Oh my god! I'm such an idiot. I'm such an idiot. Why did I do that? Oh my god. Okay, I'm back. I'm not sure if I actually have less money this time. I probably do. Uh, but, yeah, the really sad part is that, um... I think there's actually a save point right... Yeah, there's a save point right up there, and you could probably take it. So what you have to do is take this up to the top. 
but don't let it squish you. Actually, no, it doesn't go all the way to the top. Here's a save point. Yeah, we definitely want to take all these save points. Okay, <clears throat> so by this point, in terms of where to go, um, I'm going to want to go, because if I go around, yeah, that's going to lead to another chest up there. So I think that'll be the key that I go for now. What the hell are you all doing here? Can't seem to bust through this door. How else are we going to get that to that mech? Maybe there's a switch somewhere deeper in the factory. The laugh scares me though. Perhaps you can take a look. Hmm, I see. So we have to uh, do something about this here, huh? Okay, well, sure, I'll give it a shot. So we're gonna go this way. Um, cause this room here does actually have... Let's see. Oh god. Gotta be careful there. Okay, this room over here is gonna have a, um... It's gonna be a pathway to a chest in just a little bit. This was gonna be the chills. Have you ever played Crash Resistances? I happen to start on my entertainment ship. It's a nice distraction from this freaky place. I seriously hope there's no actual ghost here. Hmm. Okay, well, let's see what we can find. The hell? That looks suspicious there. Um. I think we're gonna go... Does this lead to a... Uh... No, this just reconnects back that way, which I don't actually care for. There's nothing of value over here. What I want to do, though, is find the pathway... Oh, but you know what? I can't actually reach that pathway. Oh, yes, I can. I can break this stuff. Okay. Well, ugh, I did that wrong. Crap. Let me kill you again. It's actually giving some pretty decent money. Alright, so you have to be careful here. You have to go... Ugh. There's a way to do this, but I don't actually... No. I think I'm supposed to attack sideways. Let's see if that works. I mean, yeah. It's just gonna be a little tricky. Yeah, go like that, and then here we can go... Like that, and then you go like this. There we go. It's a little tough, but you have to just be a little strategic with how you do that. And this here, and that's just another piece of heart. So we'll take it, gladly. That's two. Now we're gonna turn back, and this time go the other way. So now we're just gonna... Very slowly. Oh, thank you for responding again. More money for me. Okay, so... That was it for that side. We're gonna turn back and go the other direction now. From this point on... So the bottom right is actually closed off, as you know. There is an alternative pathway. If I end up taking... Uh, I just gotta pick a slide. Let's just go this way and see what we can find. Because there is still a lot to the Haunted Factory that we haven't yet explored. Okay, you gotta be very careful with this. Don't let this thing squish you. Oh my god. Alright. From here, this is a humongous room. Um, I think I want to start by going up. Because down here, see that's closed, so I'm going to have to actually access this from the other side. Because, uh, yeah, it would have to only be the other way, so I'm going to actually have to do that. We'll see how this goes. Okay, so something over there. I'm going to go this way. This leads to a save point. Okay, we'll take that. There is a <clears throat> secret, I believe it's down here. Yep, right over here. This contains a, um, it's a TV hat. 
And there's another secret over here. And this one contains a lot of money, 160 money. That's two treasures right there. Perfect. So we've done that. Now we can actually explore the top right, which that's going to be our next destination. What the hell are these enemies? They give you seven money each. Okay. Where are you coming at? Where are you at? There you go. The Olympic team's got you. Oh boy. Oh my god. A little nerve wracking, huh? Okay, there's another thing. Oh my god. Dude, I'm dead. Yeah, this, this is gonna be tough. This is gonna be tough. There's things falling from the top that will insta kill you. There's those annoying enemies that spawn and do damage every time. And there's also spikes. That's gonna be very tough to get through. But there is a chest up there, and we do have to try and go for that. So, it's gonna keep trying. We are currently at five chests. Okay. Yeah, see, that one's easier because there's only two things going on at once, but the one over here is going to be the problem one. Shit. The whistles do it over here, see? There we go. Oh my god, how did I... No! Stupid! This is tough. This is very tough because you can't really control what's happening here. Um, if I want to go for that, I think what I actually have to do is... Yeah, there's nothing over there. We have to go around like this, I think. Yes, exactly. I'm gonna open that for some money. Okay. Move into the next room. Another pretty large room here. For this one, there is another chest. Oh god. Oh, I actually have to avoid those. My bad. kill them all. Yeah, so there's pathway that way. We're not gonna... Okay, just... I didn't mean to jump right there. God damn it. Uh... Just kind of gotta set them off, you know? Alright, well we kind of made it over there. The chest is over here. This one contains another heart piece. That's already three, can you believe it? Oh my god. We just need one more piece. And we'll be good. Alright, so that's it for this room. Now we have to... Make our way... Oh god. A little nerve-wracking, all these freaking mines everywhere. But yeah, that's all out there is there, so now we're gonna go like this. And there's a save point over here. Oh, thank god. Okay. I'm just nervous about dying over here, you know, because you gotta do so much all over again if you die. Wonderful, wonderful. What the hell? How are you supposed to get through there? Jesus. That was a little insane. Okay, so these here... Well, okay, there, there is a... Um, I actually have to figure this out. No, I think I'm dead. Uh, no, it's, it's further down. Okay, it's further down. Good to know. There's a plunger hat down there. But I think I do have to go all the way around. And you'll see, because it's on the bottom right corner of that room. Okay, so the one that I don't actually know... Yeah, I don't actually know what the hell. How to dodge those things. It's kind of weird. Okay, so we'll go like this. 
And then here we're going to have to wait for this thing to drop down. So we can fall here. These? Yeah, they, they don't fall anymore. Here it is, this one. This is the plunger hat. We will take it. That's hilarious, okay. Now let's keep going. Uh, in terms of our map here, we are at 8 out of 10. Wait a minute, oh, never mind, never mind. We actually have a lot, what the hell? Oh my god. Seriously? Well, that's not good. Because I need my health. How am I going to get through this freaking room? That's definitely not good. Okay, I have to figure this out. There's got to be a way to get through that room without taking damage. But I just... That is interesting because you don't you can't fit through there. You know? Hmm. And then this doesn't work. Well, I guess it kind of works. But see that I don't think that's what they want you to do. No, that's definitely not what they want you to do. Am I just completely blanking out on this? How... That is very odd. Because I really only have... Hmm... Well... I guess you have to just set him off and take a hit. I, I think it's impossible to get through there without taking a single hit. I think you have to take one hit. It doesn't seem possible to be able to get through that thing fast enough. I, I don't know. I, I'm not entirely sure. I really don't know for sure. But it, it just seems... If it is possible to go through without a hit, you have to be pixel perfect with, how, with what you actually do. Which is very difficult, of course. Oh boy. My god, man. That was insanely difficult. Okay. Well, we did it. Get that. Go ahead and do that. And that does open this door here. So this one will actually let us go. Okay, I see. It essentially opens the pathway down. So that's good. Um, everything else has already been explored there. So we have 9 out of 10. We're missing only one treasure, which I think it's actually down towards the bottom. To the There's a boss down at the very bottom. We're going to have to deal with that thing eventually. So it's going to go down for now. Oh, actually. Where does this go? This just goes... Yeah, that just goes back that way, but there's no items in there. So we're just going to avoid that. It's not too big of a deal. And then here, there is a door this way, but it's closed off, okay. Oh, Jesus. I'm trying to... There we go. Got you. Gotta be very careful here, you know. Hmm. Okay, here I'm gonna have to wait for this thing to drop. You gotta be extremely careful. The last thing you wanna do here is die because. Dude, oh my freaking god, dude. Oh, Jesus Christ. That's pretty rough. Okay. The freaking swinging mechanic was about to kill me right there. I'm not taking any chances here. There we go. Okay, there's two ways. The left side leads to a save point, so we want to take that one. There's also that. I don't know if that's a permanent open, because some doors in this game are actually temporary. Others are permanent. I'm not entirely sure, but... 
whatever. Okay. That one seems permanent. That's good. We unlock the shortcut. Now I can run down here. This is going to be another pretty tough room. There's a lot of these rooms where you just have to, you know, it's more so just dodging, you know, stuff. Oh god. Yeah, so you, know, you just got to be quick. It sometimes helps to be a lot quicker, I would say. Just to that way, if you just get hit, you'll just get hit like once or twice because you basically went through everything, you know. But if you take your time and you're not doing too well, you're gonna get hit by literally everything. Use those invincibility frames, you know. Oh god. Just go, just go. It's not too big of a deal. Then, okay, we're gonna have to... Oh boy. Yeah, see, that's what I'm talking about right there. That's... Oh god. Just be very careful, be very careful. We got this. No, no, no. Shoot. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. We just... We, we actually did pretty well, I think. I'm pretty sure we did. Save point, and next time we're actually gonna deal with that boss. And we're gonna get a pretty nice item. Um, actually, you know what? Should we just do it now? I guess we should. There's no harm, right, in doing this. Really? The grips on these machine guns seem to match your hands perfectly. SMGs. Pretty sure there's a boss. Wow, look at that. It says down. Wait, how do... Oh, I see, yeah. You, you float, you float, okay. It's a floating mechanic. Oh, okay, I wanted to get rid of you. So you do down. How do you do this again? I'm trying to remember this. I remember it was a little wonky. Yeah, it go like that. Okay. And then here's the boss. Furious Pharaoh. We'll see how this goes. Gotta refill. What the hell are you doing? Oh god. Yeah, these things, these things have to do a lot of damage, I just realized. Oh my god. Actually are a pretty pretty rough. Oh my freaking god. No, I'm dead. Oh shit. I kinda got the hang of it there, but oh my god, dude. Oh jeez. You're still alive? Oh my god. This is gonna be very... Yeah, okay, well, we're dead. You kinda saw the battle, I don't know how I actually start the next video. Um, we'll see. So before I end this video, don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and turn on notifications if you enjoyed the video. I will see you all later. Bye-bye everyone, have a great day.